welcome back to my channel. It's me, TD Ready Rebecca Your Screens. Once again, I hope that all is well with you all. Okay, so you guys already voted. So I think if you voted C, you already know what we are going to be reviewing in today's video. I have to express the little dilemma that I experienced, which was I went to all the surrounding clicks that are like around me and I could not find it. And I went to um, ben Moore. No, Ben Moore was where I found it. But before I got it, I had to first go to Morningside Center, The Wedge, and I was this close to going to Santon City. But before you get to Santon City, that you have to pass Ben Moore. So I was just like perfection. I found it there, but even then, it was not available at a clicks. I found it at Discam. Discam is like on the second floor in case you're trying to go get it there. And unfortunately, it was the last one. And even though I was really feeling hormonal, thank God my husband was with me because I genuinely could not see it. I was just like, love, love, look. This oil is not here. What am I gonna do? And I was just like, it means like the following day, I'm gonna have to like drive to Rosebank and go figure out if it's there and or go to Sandton City. So anyway, we found it. We found the oil that we are going to be reviewing. This is the MPL Hair Oil 5 Oils. It is a blend of five natural oils, castor oil, coconut oil, olive oil, jojoba, and argan oil. It is supposed to nourish, moisturize, and add shine to your hair. So let us do a quick close-up. So the oil has a little like a dropper situation so I think it comes out as drops just like so well as soon as it decides to come out is this sealed what's going on oh uh, okay you have to like really go in there I don't know if I like this so I'm gonna remove this because it does not make sense because I think the oil may be too thick and this just may be too thick for the oil to try to like maneuver through so anyway so this is the oil let us check out the consistency first before we do anything okay she's definitely thick she's very thick so i'm just putting it back in there she's thick you can okay <laughs> for those who have actually smelled the original castor oil like castor oil that is not processed and the scent is still there this has like an undertone like of castor oil if that makes any sense like that scent like for black people so you guys must let me know since i've got viewers from the us kenya nigeria canada uk let me know growing up all my south africans will know where i'm going with this growing up did your parents make you detox as a child because you were eating too many sweets or whatever the case may be like maybe it was thanksgiving and you guys were just gonna eat nonsense so your parents would i guess make you detox all the junk food so that your stomach can work well in south africa we did that and every time i would go to visit my dad in december he would make us drink castor oil i hated it i used to gag my sisters used to gag and throw it up and we can detox and like clean our stomachs so this is giving castor oil for real and the cool thing about it that i think we should actually take into consideration is that the first ingredient in here is castor oil so if this is not telling you that it's probably like well, maybe like 75 percent if not 65 percent castor oil in here and then the rest of the other oils i don't know i don't know what to tell you so i feel like this is a cool affordable oil that you can use i got this for 160 did I just say 100? I got this for 79 Rand. And funny enough, I was there looking at the other options that you guys did not pick. And Jackie's cost 260. I could not believe my eyes. My Sony was not there. I didn't even look for it because I was looking for what you guys voted for. But I just happened to see and also share with my husband that I asked you guys. And nobody voted on Jackie. Is that something I should know? Let me know in the comment section. So let us put this oil on my hair and see what goes. Here's what I do want to say though. I genuinely think that I need to do like a scalp rinse of some sort so that because I'm using like a new oil, 
I want to make sure that I'm starting like on a clean scalp but for the sake of today's video because it is a review of the MPL oil I want to just apply it and I think I will do like a rinse at the gym just before I step into the sauna and steam room. I'll rinse my hair. I'm not gonna wash it. I'm gonna rinse my hair. Quick question. Do you guys wash your hair when it's in rain? Let me know. Let me know because I'm curious to find out because I've never really done it. I do rinses because I work out except okay hold on my arms are looking fire. Okay so because I come from the shower my hair is still a little bit like misty like which is great. Um, I like to moisturize straight from the shower because my hair is still like damp. We will see how my hair looks like on Sunday uh, when we do our second moisturizing routine. And then, yeah, and I'll just take it from there. So I've just used my spritzer to moisturize my hair. And now we're going to go in with the oil. Just like so. I'm going to like, I always... <laughs> I always actually moisturize my hair facing down like I always go like this and the reason for that is because do you guys know of something called the inversion method if not it's basically when you moisturize your hair facing down because some people believe that it will like encourage growth but um, yeah it started as that like on my first natural hair journey it started as that like i used the inversion method for that particular reason but because i've always done it even though i don't believe in it anymore i still just moisturize my hair that way because also it just feels a little bit better when your face your hair is facing downward because you can literally focus on your scalp so i'm not trying to do too much as well with the oil i focus most of it at the back so i'm just gonna do a little bit like a titch more and then focus that like on my edges like that and then like the middle part and the sides of my hair so that's kind of like it so you guys who are from america are going to get to see i don't know why i just said it like that sorry <laughs> so for those who are in south africa or overseas you guys are going to get to see if this MPL is going to be growing my hair because on the second hair growth journey that I'm on and I'm sharing it with you guys, that's the one thing I actually do want to share is like take serious more than anything is um, just take it easy with my hair. But more than taking it easy, I want to actually grow my hair in the simplest ways ever. I don't want to do too much. Like this time around, the aim is not to sweat um that's what south africans say when they're dancing like the aim is not not to sweat you guys know tyler you you know tyler obviously you know tyler and she's from here she's a girl from Germany, like me um and she's a good dancer and she does not sweat when she's dancing and the aim is not to sweat you see how chris brown dances sometimes he does too much south africans we do it slick okay we don't do too much i just grabbed my uh, leave-in conditioner this is the perfect hair mangram line color care leave-in conditioner that i've always loved it's affordable it's literally a hundred rand and it lasts me for like four months or three months depending on how i'm using it you know um yeah so i'm just sealing everything in with my leave-in conditioner and then i'm not even gonna put um shea butter today because i feel like the oil, I just want to give it its time to shine, you know, I want the oil to shine. So those are my first thoughts regarding the oil. There isn't much I can say right now about the oil except just to review it with you guys and see where it takes me. But I'm going to finish off my hair because I have a market to attend um, and then we're just going to take it there. Uh, and just take it easy so i'm gonna style up my hair finish up i'm not sure what i want to do to it it'll probably be in a bun because sometimes when your hair is done you can't think straight and i feel like today what's wrong with this braid oh, okay i need to fix the end okay um and when my hair's like in front of me i can't think straight so i'm just gonna put this hair up in a bun and i hope you guys have enjoyed the video let me know if you are going to be trying the oil um as mentioned for those who are abroad uh, you will not know the oil. I don't know if this is an international brand. I highly, it's made in South Africa. I don't know if it's like international like that, whereby you can try it out. But should you ever try to come to South Africa one day, 
get your hands on this obviously depending if it's gonna be my hair or not okay so get your hands on this and then we'll just take it from there okay so thank you guys so much for watching today's video i will be seeing you guys on sunday because now that we have oil that's the second time i'll be moisturizing my hair for the week this is the first time i'm moisturizing my hair so it makes a whole lot of sense comment below like what's your moisturizing schedule especially if you are in braids do you moisturize once or twice the reason why i'm asking is because as mentioned in my previous video that sometimes when we are in a protective style we think that it's a good time for us to neglect our hair but i don't think you should be doing that it's probably the worst thing that you can do for your hair you want your protective style to help you retain the length that you've already gained therefore you want to take care of it while it's still in braids it's still your hair at the end of the day even though it's like in a protective style so let me know do you moisturize your hair how many times a week and do you wash your hair when you're in braids especially for those who keep their braids for like three months extended times you know so let me know in the comment section and i'll see you guys in my next one thank you guys so much for voting i was scared that you guys were not going to interact with me so i want you guys to know that i really really appreciate you guys voting more than anything i'm really trying to improve my engagement so i will appreciate it if you guys could just give this video a thumbs up and comment 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 if you are excited to see me this use this or answer the two questions I just asked okay cool bye